Father's Day and uh, I got to go for a ride with my old man. Seems, it doesn't seem like much, but to me it's, it's a lot. It, when you're a little kid, you think everything your dad does is the coolest fucking thing ever. And when I was about like two, or no, about three years old, he used to set me on the tank of his dirt bikes and run up and down the street, do wheelies on it. And I don't know if that like, those moments left such an impression that like changed the physiology of my brain or if I'm like genetically predisposed to be obsessed with motorcycles, but I was pretty well hooked after that. Uh, pretty thankful for it. I'm pretty thankful for the type of man that he is, the kind of man that he is. And riding with him, it means something to me. It's like, it's like our thing. Like nobody else, nobody else can have that. That's just the one thing that him and I get to have together. A lot of you know how important writing is be able to share that with somebody that my best friend that I love more than anything in the whole world. I, I, I can try and explain it, but I don't think you quite understand. I don't think anyone can. When I was about two, he got me a mini bike. Right? He, he wanted me to be a as much interested in the things that he enjoyed and have as much passion for those things. So he like, you know, got me a mini bike. Look at that. <laughs> the bike was so bitching. Ah, oh, shirt off and everything. <laughs> Times haven't really changed that much. <laughs> I still ride with my shirt off everywhere. <laughs> uh, 25 years later, still doing the same shit. That's funny. I remember we used to work on like old busted ass three wheelers and stuff together. And anytime he was in the garage working on a bike, I was right there, you know, just trying to be up in the mix, just trying to spend time with him, but also because I just love that stuff. I remember thinking how cool my dad was riding a bike. He'd be out there blasting on his car, like, ah! flying up and down the road. And, Man, that's fucking cool. I want to be like that. I want to be, you know, every little kid wants to be like their dad when they grow up. Every little boy, I should say. So yeah, writing, writing is, it's something that I, I haven't got to do a lot of. And I want to make a point to do more of it. Because amidst all this corona bullshit and everything that's going on, it's just highlighted the things that mean the most to me. I'm getting to actually appreciate them. This, this game of life, it's a short game and I want to be able to have these experiences to look back on. Anyhow, so happy Father's Day, Rick. I love you more than anything in the whole world. You, you'll, you won't see this, but uh, I have it, I made it. And I want people to see how much you mean to me. So, I love you, Dad.